Okay, for this language, we have uh, two criteria that we have to match. We have to, first of all, have strings that end with B, and the second thing is we have to have strings that don't contain AA. So really, we need two separate paths here to think about. We'll have one path that we use for strings that end with B, and another path to sort of take care of strings that do contain the substring AA at some point. Okay, so we'll have a total of four different states in order to implement that. This will be our initial state. This will be our final. In terms of transitions, we'll start with the simplest string that we could have, which would be something that just contains a B. And on the other hand, we'll also start with the simplest thing that could get us into a for sure reject situation, which would be an A, A. Okay, if we see AA, then we know that the string can't be inside, or, or in the language rather, so we won't accept it. And so this Q3 here is actually going to be a sync state. Once we get into it, we'll never come out. Okay, so if we ever see AA, we go to the sync state and never come out because the string can't be accepted. All right, now we have to think about the way that the rest of this would work. If we have read a B and see more Bs, then we'll stay in the accepting state because the string would end with B. So I'll put a B transition there. On the other hand, if we read a B and then an A, that's the first in a potential AA substring, so we'll go to Q2. Let's rearrange these a little bit. Okay. If we're in Q2 and we read a B, that means that we go to the final state. And there we go. Now we have a finite state machine that recognizes strings that end in B but don't contain AA. So let's run a couple examples. Uh, let's see. A, B, A, B, A, B. So that should be a string in the language. And when we run this, we should sort of ping pong back and forth between Q2 and Q1 as each character is read. And since we end with a B, we accept the string. If we run for an input that doesn't have what we need, because it contains AA, to start off with, things are looking pretty good, but then we read an A, it's the first one of the potentially rejecting substring, and then the second one moves us to Q3, which is our sync state, and I never get out of there. So now this uh, string is not accepted. 